Well, your local mother claims similar abuse this time with the sheriff's department. Our Byron Scott is joining us now with those details. And she's quite upset in this. The mother of a man who was shot to death by Prince George's County Sheriff's deputy plans to file a lawsuit. Michelle Minor says she wants justice for her son. Now, police were called to the 2300 block of Houston Street in Suitland for a domestic dispute. This was last October. Now, investigators say 38 year old Michael Minor and his girlfriend had an argument and that she called 911. Now, police say Minor failed to follow orders and was making hand movements when he was shot by a deputy. Now, Minor was unarmed at the time. His mother says she wants the deputy sheriff charged. Because this has affected my whole family, my whole family. My mother wasn't even able to attend my son's funeral. She cannot participate in any part of this activity in regarding my son. And it's awful, and I feel very bad. We're saying that um, Ferguson has come to Prince George's County and that Michael Minor is our Michael Brown. And the reason we say that is because um, we, this mother needs answers, this grieving mother needs answers. And the fundamental question, and this is why we're having the press conference, this is why we're going to have a rally, is under what conditions is it all right for police to shoot and kill an unarmed black man? Now, Branch and Minor are scheduled to hold a press conference tomorrow. They are planning also a town meeting for some time, they say, next week. And we talked to the prosecutor's office. They say, as of right now, no comment, maybe tomorrow. All right. All right. Thank Thanks. you, Byron, for that report.